So we're in uh, the water couch now with Mar Margaret Betty from WaterAid, International Campaigns Manager. Can you show us your badge, please? So, Margaret, can you share with us? I understand that uh, WaterAid and others are, have, have launched a big international campaign today. It's an exciting day to date. May I say in advance, Happy Water Day to you from tomorrow. Same to you. Yes, it's very exciting to be in the Hague with everyone in the water sector talking about water and sanitation. We took the opportunity today to launch a report called Everyone Everywhere. I happen to have a copy here. Everyone Everywhere. This is uh, WaterAid's vision for water and sanitation and hygiene in the post-2015 world. And we were thrilled actually this morning that President Ellen Johnson Sirleaf from Liberia uh, referred to and launched our report because she is the global champion for sanitation in Africa. Mm -hmm. Okay, and what, what are the um, campaign sort of elements in this international uh, campaign that you're starting now? We've got three main asks. So one is universal access to water and sanitation and hygiene. So that's the everyone. Everywhere is about reducing inequalities. So we don't just want the big numbers. We want everyone to have water and sanitation, but we want to reach those that are most marginalised, the poorest, whether it's disabled people, people with HIV AIDS, women, children, could be people in urban areas or rural areas, wherever there's disadvantage, discrimination, reduce inequalities. And uh, we want all of this by 2030. By 2030. So it's pretty ambitious, mm. but we think it's possible. And actually the buzz in the conference today in The Hague is all about achieving the possible. There's a real energy here saying, you know, over the last couple of decades, two billion people have reached access to water. So now we have about 800 million remaining. We can do that in the next 20 years. So 2030 is our target date. Mm -hmm. uh, water rate is active in about 25 countries, I think. Uh, which, which is, the, in your experience, uh, if you, you know, this is now campaigning at the international level. Yes. You, you are influencing policies also at national level. Can you share maybe a good example of that recently, uh, yeah, where, sure. where your, advoca your advocacy and lobbying work is paying off? Yeah, absolutely. Um, gosh, which do I choose? There's so many, but I'll, I'll tell you something that happened last month, actually, in February in Nigeria. Um, and it was, the result, it was a very nice tie-in with something called the Sanitation and Water for All Partnership, which brings together governments, Dutch government, UK government, the World Bank, UNICEF, national governments, finance ministers and so on, brings them all together to look at rational commitments to water and sanitation and targeting of wash aid. meeting happened last April in Washington at the World Bank, and just in February, the president of Nigeria said, hey, why is Nigeria doing so badly on water and sanitation? We need to do something different. And as a result, all the campaigning, the advocacy, the policy, the evidence that come through to the president in, in Nigeria and his very active finance minister in Gozi, they decided to hold a summit on sanitation. And effectively, they, the joke was that the, the country of Nigeria virtually came to a standstill because most of the cabinet were at this conference for a whole day. And they were looking at their record on water and sanitation and saying, this isn't good enough, we need to do more. So real commitment, and that was a real result of uh, many types of advocacy, from campaigning to letter writing to reports and so on. The evidence is very, very important. And the people power, and actually as we speak, there are, I think, approximately 350,000 people walking for water and sanitation through the End Water Poverty Coalition. So that gets noticed by politicians, and, and WaterAid works with other partners, many, many others, through End Water Poverty to support those kind of initiatives. And the good of, of it is that is that tomorrow, of course, also we do the water walks from here. Ah, uh, yes. So from absolutely. all over the world. So thanks very much for sharing. This Thank with you, us. sir. It was a pleasure.